Kelsey Pucho, Mabuhay, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to do my very first unboxing for a Mommy Essentials. So if you're interested to know what this item is, just stay tuned. Hey loves, welcome back! By the way, if you're new to my channel, welcome! Hi, my name is Roma and it is so nice to meet you. I make videos such as hauls, unboxings, reviews, updated reviews of some luxury as well as contemporary items. And I also added brand new um, topic which is within the motherhood edition. So if you are into those topics, please consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification bell. That way you won't miss any of my videos. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment in the comment section down below. Let me know what you think about it as it will really help the algorithms of my channel. And for those of you who are on Instagram, please check me out on Instagram where I do post some OOTD and where I do share the different items that I am unboxing and reviewing in this channel and um, post it and show it how I wear them on a day-to-day -day basis. And lastly, I would like to thank my returning subscribers for your support and for always tuning in. So before I start this video, I would like to let you know that I have put timestamps throughout the video. I will put all the details in the description down below so you can check out the different chapters. If you're more interested to one chapter than the other, you can check that out so you can skip from one chapter to another. Okay, so without further ado, I am going to reveal the item, but first and foremost, I'm going to unbox it. So it actually arrived. Um, let me just have a look. I'm just going to, yeah, like that. So this is how the item arrived in this brown paper bag. Um, and if I'm not mistaken, I don't know if, the, if it has been opened, but I am going to show you. So we're going to open it first and then I'm going to give you all the details concerning what this is. So just a quick unboxing. A small paper, brown paper bag. I have the receipt and just a second. Bear with me, guys. Bear with me. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this is empty. As you can see. Keep it here, and this is the item that I am going to unbox again. Well, take it out from this plastic um, biodegradable um, bag that is made from corn starch. Apparently, all the details are mentioned in here, and the item is. <gasps> It's a handbag, but it's actually a mommy bag. <laughs> okay, just a sec. I am going to clear this out so you can easily see it. So this is how it looks like. So I'm just going to take this off. And yeah, this is a mommy bag. A diaper bag actually um, from the brand I don't know if you will be able to see it from the brand Pacapod so there you have it that is the reveal of my Pacapod Firenze diaper bag okay so now I'm going to talk about the specs concerning this um, 
diaper bag. So I am going to film the diaper bag and then I'm going to give you the details concerning the item itself. So this is actually a three-in-one organizing system which includes changer pod, feeder pod, pram clips and changing mat. As you can see in here, the pods can be removed to use the bag independently. So this handbag can also be used as a, um, a normal weekender bag. You can put some, you can put your laptops, uh, it can fill in the cargo area. It also has straps, uh, it carry handles and convertible backpack straps. As you can see in here, there are pockets, there are two side pockets, and there's also an internal pocket containing key fob, plus two open inside pockets. The dimension of the handbag itself, it's 28 centimeters by 42 by 21. And the volume, it has a 24 liter capacity with uh, 8 liters extra including the pod so in total it has a volume of 32 liters of capacity in total and then the way of this handbag is 1.5 kilo the material itself this one is in the black vegan pebble leather and the feeder pod standard uh, it is BPA free white clean inner and flat it's free and it is tested to EC and BS food standard. So as you have seen on that B-roll, this handbag is indeed a Firenze handbag. That is what it is called. So this is a Firenze pack. It is an adaptation of Packapod's best-selling Butai award-winning Firenze. It's crafted with all the best features they know we future moms love uh, a changing bag weekender and backpack all rolled into one and this is made from tumble pebble vegan leather and with a white clean finish and teamed with gunmetal hardware all around as you can see and lastly this handbag currently retails for 161 euros 0.95 in january 2023 okay so now i'm going to talk about the reason why i opted for this specific diaper bag so first and foremost i opted for the brand puckapod because my sister who was also pregnant and due earlier earlier than me she found this through a video in on youtube where um someone has mentioned this diaper bag and she was like it's really a very nice one because it's not when you look at it like that you're not you know you don't see it immediately as a diaper bag and that is what I also wanted to have as a diaper bag. I don't want it to be, you know, too much in your face. Oh, that's a diaper bag. In this case, it can be, you can, yeah, you can take that. It's a weekender and it can also be used as a weekender bag. So that is what I, first of all, loved about the bag itself. And then the second thing is I opted for this uh, diaper bag because it has everything that I need for a diaper bag it means that it has it came with pram clips so I can swing it off on the pram handle and then I can also wear it as a backpack uh, because there are some straps if I'm not mistaken if you put the straps here at the back um, I'm just going to show you if I can so inside I have the straps in here so when you put the straps on the side here I can wear it as a backpack so if ever I have to carry uh, the baby I have both of my hands uh, free 
and then it also um, it distributes uh, way and allow easy carrying with a baby in a slick and then it's also large enough um, that as you can see in here when I open it I'm just going to take it off it really has a lot of space inside that uh, it's large enough and has a special pocket for my laptop which is in here on this side um, so there's a zipper in here there's a zipper on the other side and then there are some pockets as well um, yeah so I can put it's a large enough that it has a special special pocket either for a laptop or uh, an iPad for example so I can really keep my personal stuff separate from my baby stuff uh, or just for grown-ups <laughs> and there's an easy access um, outer pocket so in here on the side well there's some pockets on the side as you can see on both sides and for example if I close the zipper here above so if I close this in front you can see there's an easy access uh, outer pockets where I can also open it and visible like that so um, I can also put uh, here on the side some key here a key fob and yeah it, it can be used not just a diaper bag I can use it like I've mentioned as a work bag gym bag or a carry-on too so it has I can put the slings here the pods inside there easy access the changing pod and close everything in an easy access and it also has this um, pacifier holder so yeah so that is the other reason why I like the handbag itself because it has really a lot of different uh, alternatives use so that's a plus lastly I opted for the color black because they actually have two types of colors they have it in black one and they have it in oak so the oak is more of a camel color and I was really debating at first if I wanted the oak one because it's really nice too but at the end of the day I opted for the black one because I think it 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 will really be more it will suit well my um, my personal stuff as well as the pram that we bought for our baby which is in the color black the Nuna and it's in the riveted version so it also has all those gunmetal hardware so that's why I wanted it because this handbag I want it also if my husband has to you know carry it it's more unisex and then lastly I opted for the option of overall package because on the website it, it exists with overall package which means that you receive two pods inside a changing pad the the pacifier holder and uh, for the time being they also offer just going to show you I haven't unboxed it yet they also offer when you purchase something on the website they also offer you this baby muslin and bamboo so this is also a freebie and this actually cost um, 20 pounds so this one is free and yeah I opted for all of this because all in all all of this cost be last year because I purchased this in Fe um, December 2022 it was 165.95 euro but like I have mentioned right now currently January 2023 it has decreased in price it's 161.95 instead of 165.95 and um, but you can also purchase it uh, and customize it yourself and if you do that you only have the handbag 
so without the pacifier holders which is the head bag and that cost 137.95 euro so yeah so those were the reasons why i opted for this diaper bag for the versatility for the elegance and for the contemporary feel and where i can use it not just as a diaper bag but as a work bag gym bag or a carry-on bag okay so now that i have talked about why i opted for this specific diaper bag now i'm just going to give you a feedback of how the purchase went as well as the shipping and handling since i'm living in belgium so in europe this brand actually is from the uk so it means that the prices were in pounds but it can be changed in you converted in your um country's currency so i opted for the euros so i had it like i've mentioned prior i had it for 165.95 euros but you can have a discount of 10 percent if you um if you subscribe to their newsletter which i did but afterwards i was you know at first still debating if i wanted this because 165 euros is still quite expensive just for a diaper bag even though i can use it alternatively other than the diaper bag i can use it like i mentioned as a weekender or a carry-on bag or whatsoever but still i think 165 euros it's too expensive so it was just in my cart so this is an advice i'm giving you guys afterwards i think um few minutes later i received an email from pakapod and they sent me a um discount code of 15 percent so i had to put come back 15 i don't know if that will be the same if you do it right now but at least uh well when i did it last month last december it was the case so i have been able to have a discount of 15 percent from the 165 and then added to that since it was coming from the uk going to the eu i had some shipping cost which was 17 euros 95 and with all of that there's a vat of around 23 euros 51 so i was all in all in total it was 159 euros point one cent so uh, let's say 159 euros in short so i was like okay good enough um it was a lot lesser than the initial price so i was like okay let's have it anyways it's a very nice uh diaper bag very versatile like i've mentioned the color is nice and i saw it first when my sister bought it and the quality was really great so i was like okay let's go with it and for the european shipping from the uk to your Euro uh europe it uh, they mentioned on their website that it can take up to 14 days so um all in all i have uh purchased it on the 6th of december and it actually arrived on the 23rd of december so it was quite long to be honest but it was long because in the middle of those two dates i have received an email from the customs because yeah there's some custom fees <laughs> Uh, so I had to pay for in addition to the 159 euros I had to pay 41 euros and 96 cents uh, so it was a 15 and 26.90 VAT so all in all I've paid 41 euro 96 plus 159 for the initial price so yeah I was more than all in all in the 200 euros mark uh, for the diaper bag and i know that it was it's quite expensive for what it is but like i have mentioned i think at the end of the day i 
will still be satisfied for what it is, for what I got, because it's something that I don't really see here in Belgium that other moms have as a diaper bag. And yeah, it came with a lot of different stuff. Like I mentioned, it came with these two pods, a black one where I can put uh this one is yeah this is with temperate i mean you can keep hot or cold in here and this is for diaper sorry diaper stuff and then i have the changing pad portable changing pad so that is good also and then i have this um so one where i can put his pacifier so and then i have the handbag itself with a freebie baby muslin so in short i'm still happy that even though it has cost me 200 euros i'm still sat satisfied that i have purchased this from uh, Packapod. The only downside is, as you have seen on my unboxing in the beginning of this video, it arrived in this, you know, just a second, just in this brown paper bag. And for something that, you know, will pass through the customs, I think that it is too fragile to put the handbag in that kind of packaging i was hoping it to be in a boxed uh, package just you know because of the shipping handling and customs but i think maybe if they have put it in a box maybe the um customs might be a lot more expensive i don't know but at the end of the day it arrived well it arrived uh even before christmas so i was like you know a christmas gift for the mommy to be and when i have i've unboxed it everything is in good condition so all in all i'm very satisfied for the um experience that i have uh, purchasing it online having the discount code and then seeing the results of how it looks like and cannot wait to use it so there you go guys that was my reveal and unboxing of the Pakapod Firenze bag in the color black. I hope that this video has helped some of you mummies, <laughs> future mummies out there, um, or even daddies uh, that are, you know, in a search of a different type of diaper bag that you can also use as another kind of bag, not just for diapers uh, and if that was the case please give this video a thumbs up and let me know what you think about the video itself in the comment section down below and i'll be happy to read them out and if you have any questions concerning the bag itself or more details on how the shipping handling and the purchase experience experience was let me know in the comment section down below i'll be happy to answer you and if you have liked this video and the different topics on my channel but aren't subscribed yet please consider subscribing to my channel and don't forget to click the notification bell so you won't miss any of my videos so up until then i wish you all a pleasant uh, day and see you soon bye Thank you.